52 videos a year. You could do that, one a week, not too hard, use your phone. Simple as that. Hey guys, welcome to King's Tech Review. My name is Daniel King and um, I'm so excited that you can join me here. So guys, if you haven't liked, share or subscribed to my channel, I'm extending the invitation. And if you're thinking about starting a YouTube channel, think about teaching. Teaching, teaching somebody on the other side that doesn't know and doesn't have the sort of information that you have. Creating value for people is one of the best feelings that you could ever do in life. All right. And this is what we want to do on our YouTube channel. First thing I want to talk to you about is make a plan. Make a plan, guys. You have to make a plan. Success is planned. Failure is is not planned. Failure happens to you. Guys, if you want to get to any destination, okay, you first have to have a plan. If I want to go back home to the Caribbean, I have to decide, okay, I'm going to call up the airlines, I am going to book a ticket, I'm going to pay for that ticket, and I'm going to plan myself to get to my destination, which is the Caribbean. Put together a calendar as what you're going to do for 2022. The directions that you're going to take, the plans that you're going to make, especially when it comes to YouTube channel, your YouTube channel, think about the lighting that you're going to use. Because I always think about my lighting. Think about the backgrounds, what you want in your backgrounds. I, I encourage you, emulate me. What I'm doing, just do it. And most of these lightings are very, very inexpensive. I'm going to put links to those lightings at the bottom. So check out the links at the bottom. So you'll be able to see the gear that I have, the lights, the cameras, you know, the, the gear that I use, the microphones. Now, if you don't have them, I also have a next solution. Use your cell phone and start producing content. Okay, so let me tell you about my plan. I am going to produce three videos a week. Okay, now if you can't produce three videos a week, I would encourage you to produce one video a week. That would be 52 videos in a year time. This is January, I believe that, but I want to hit my numbers. My numbers is 156 videos I want to produce in this year. All right, what is your goal? Let me know in the comments, what is your goal? How much videos do you want to produce this year? So I'm encouraging you, 52 videos, one video a week, okay? 100 and, no, what is that? Two, bring the two, two and two is four, okay, 104, okay? That's what you could do. You get 100 videos out this year if you do two a week. All right. So think about it and start producing. So the next question I want to ask you is what habit do you need to learn this year? What do you need to learn? Do you need lighting? You need to learn about lighting, how you should structure your cameras, how you should get the software engaged and learn the software. Yeah, you may need to learn that. And that is very important. Do you want to learn how to set up your microphone to get that crispy that really nice sound that comes from a broadcaster what do you want to learn make up in your mind what do you want to learn do you want to learn information from books all right that will help you on your youtube journey do you want to learn from audio books i listen to this app called audible and you could download it and you can learn about all different types of books and learn about all subjects that may be pertaining to the niche and the genre that you're involved in. So download that app and start listening to Audible. You may need to have a subscription for it. Or, or if you want, you can go on YouTube and there's so many good information, powerful information on YouTube that you can also learn from. Repurpose those content to help those out there that just need to learn a little bit more, if you know what I'm talking about. Okay, so that's what I do. All right, I learn from books, awesome books. And I'm gonna put some links below of books that you can learn from. You can learn all these things on YouTube, how to set up your phone and your cameras on your phone because you're, you're spending a lot of money on, on, on an iPhone, over th thousands of dollars on the iPhone. You might as well get the best iPhone if you're gonna use it for video production. You don't necessarily need to go out there and purchase a, a really expensive DL DSLR like what I have right now, you know, to start producing content. You just need to, you know, just grab a, your own iPhone. Get, I would think that you should get the best quality if you're going to use, use it to produce content. And there's an app on the iPhone here that I talk about. It's called iMovie. That is a free app that you can use to start producing content. You could start learning about how to have confidence on your camera. How to have confidence on the camera. That's the next topic of discussion. 
All right. Because some people are shy, introvert, you know, and they're always wondering what people are going to say or who has a different perspective outside there that may not align with their perspective. You have to be confident in whatever you're doing. And confidence only takes time. I want to encourage you. Be confident in yourself and be confident in the ability that God has given to you. You you have skills that other people need to know about. You have skills that other people need to learn. And you can teach other people as well. All right? So don't think less of yourself. Don't think of yourself as, oh, me. <laughs> Why? No. Think about yourself as being confident. Think about the personality on television, the news director, and, and emulate what they're doing. That actor. That's how I do it. I look at actors and I emulate what they're doing. And how do we learn? We learn from other people. You understand? So don't worry about the naysayers. Get on the camera and do your thing. That's how we say back home in the Caribbean. Do your thing. I just doing my thing. So point number two. When are you going to make time for yourself? Daniel, when are you going to make your time for yourself to fulfill your dreams? To do those things that you really wanted to do. You may be thinking, boy, I wanted to start a YouTube channel a long time ago. And, you know, I'm just shy. Or you probably have told your husband or told your wife, you know, I, have, I wanted to start a YouTube channel. And they probably went out and got some gears for you. Probably got a camera. When are you going to start pumping out videos on YouTube? You have to make the difference. You have to decide, okay, I want to start next week, Monday, at such and such a time. You write it down at such and such a time. I'm going to start it on Monday at 9 a.m. when I put the kids to bed, if you have kids, or when I come home from work. Make time for yourself. Nobody else is coming to encourage you. Nobody's going to push you. You have to push yourself. You think somebody's in the back there pushing me? No, 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 no. I have to say, look, this is what I want. And I have to go for my dreams. Look, when I was back in the day, when I was younger and I used to run, I used to be outside there training, sometimes eight, nine o'clock in the night, running, pulling tires. My parents wouldn't know where I am, but I'm outside there running all alone by myself. In order for seed to grow, it has to be planted in the dark. Nobody could see you. Nobody knows that you're, you're running after your goal. You may see and may just think you're running. But you have a goal. You have a plan. You have a purpose. And that's why God put you on this earth to fulfill that purpose. You're never going to be happy if you don't succeed in that purpose. God has placed deep inside of you. Six months from now, seven months from now, a year from now, two years from now, are you going to look back in regret? Or are you going to look back in satisfaction guaranteed because you made a plan and you follow through. You plan, you do, you check, and you adjust. P-D-C-A. Plan, do, check, adjust, and what you do? You repeat it again. You keep on doing it the same thing over and over and over. That is how you're going to get success. Forget about being shy. Forget about fear. Scripture says, God has not given us a spirit of fear, but of love and of power and of a sound mind. That's good, right? God is good. He is awesome because he's the one that pushed me. He's the one that motivates me. The Bible is the book that motivates me to move forward. God is my supply of strength of power, of wisdom, of understanding. He is the one that is pushing me. He's the one that can push you. If you don't have God, I encourage you to accept him now. He will give you the desires of your heart. He will push you. He will push you the desires of your heart so that you could get it. Hallelujah. I have to talk to you guys like this because... God is the one that has inspired me all my life. I remember when they said to me in school, you will never amount to anything. You will be a beggar. You will, guys, in school, I had something called dyslexia. I couldn't read. It was difficult for me to read all the time. 
I never wanted them to call me up. And I would go in front of the, when they call me up in front of the class, and I would read as if I'm picking up chick feed. One at a time. One word at a time. Sometimes I stumble. Sometimes I stutter. So please excuse me sometimes if I stutter because I'm not the best reader. And you know something? I am still on camera because I believe in myself. I believe in the God-given talents that God has given to me. He has endowed me with... And, and, and you know what the scripture says? I can do all things through Christ that strengthened me. God will give you the power to learn to read. If you can't spell, guys, this is very important in, on your YouTube channel. If you cannot spell words, there's a lot of software online to help you spell properly, spell check. And sometimes I misspell a lot of words, but praise God for spell check. And that helps me. Seek whatever help you can get and work with it. When are you going to make time to read? When are you going to make time to listen? When are you going to make time to associate with the people that could push you forward? How many groups are you going to join? How many birds? You see, birds of a feather always flock together. You have to get into a group that pushes you, that encourages you, that motivates you to be the best that you can be. You can't be hanging out with chickens when you want to fly with the eagles. You cannot be picking up chick feed. You have to be soaring. Because without a vision, the people perish. What's your vision? Are you running after it? Are you jogging after it? Or are you sprinting after it? Now is the time to sprint. Think about who is hungry enough if you're hungry enough, you will get it. If you're not hungry, you don't get it. Because somebody outside there is more hungry than you. So there's always room at the top, you know. But you have to be hungry for it. You want a thousand subscribers? Get hungry for it. You want a million subscribers? Get hungry for it. I want a million subscribers. And I'm hungry for it. But I'm going to stay consistent. You see, YouTube is not a sprint, a hundred meter dash, but it's a marathon. It's those persons that stick to the end. Those persons that, that are, you know, are not fearful, but they're going to run after their goal. And they're going to run, and they're going to run, and they're going to run until they reach the end. The marriage YouTube is a marathon not a sprint. Write it down, guys. I'm giving you some value here today. Giving you some good information. I could tell that you guys are going to be blessed at the end of this. Remember, if you don't have motivation, call on God. Say, God, I need motivation. God, I need help. God, I need you to have my back. A seed is planted in the darkness. You see anybody around here? Nobody around here but me and this camera here. I'm talking right to you. All right? I'm talking to you. Can you understand the words that are coming out of my mouth? That's who I'm talking to. You. Guys, I want to make a difference in your life. Number three. So I want to talk to you. What is your education plan? I would encourage you. Read books in your jara. Look at videos in your jara. Listen to audios in your jara. Read, listen, and associate with people in your jara of expertise. That could make you better. That could make you grow. That is passionate about what you... You know, passionate is a good word, but obsessed is a, I think is a better word. People that are obsessed with what they are doing and with what you are doing. Follow people that are obsessed with what you are doing. Excited. When you talk to them, you see, what well, 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 aren't you, boy? <laughs> they are fanatics. They're excited. They want to see something happen. They're hungry for change. Are you hungry for change? Are you like a lion? You think about a lion when he goes out there and he's sprinting after his, his eyes are locked. And he's going after that goal. He's running. He got to get it. He has to get it. And when he pounces on that animal back and he bites and he locks, his jaws into that animal. He's coming home with lunch. <laughs> you see, when a lion looks at us, I don't want you to suffer in the shadows and wonder if I didn't do, and wonder and ask yourself, boy, you know, I should have done YouTube channel. Six months, a year from now, I should have done YouTube. 
you know, probably that may have given me some sort of leverage. But you would never know if you don't try something. Try a thing, huh? Our partner in Trinidad used to say, try a thing, man, try a thing, try a thing. Try a thing. I'm encouraging you. 52 videos a year. You could do that. One a week. Not too hard. Use your phone. Simple as that. Ain't too hard, right? Let's do it. Okay, number four. I want to tell you a little secret. This is what you're going to do. This secret is for growing your YouTube channel. The secret is you need to produce videos. Don't tell nobody. I tell you that, you know. You need to produce videos. That is the secret to growing YouTube channel. You're going after your dreams and your goals. Prosperity don't come if you sit down. Just begin to do your videos. Create your plan. And go after it like a lion. The righteous are as bold as lions. But we are harmless. You see, we are, in order for us to get our goals accomplished. You understand? What is your goals? What is your goals? You have to write it down. Write it down. And you go after it. You're writing and you're running. You're writing and you're running. You're going after it every day. It's supposed to be on your mind. Forget about the distraction of YouTube, TikTok, you know, Instagram, Facebook. Focus on one. What is focus? Focus on one thing until success. That's how you spell focus. F-O-C-U-S. You can't be focusing on TikTok and Instagram and everything at the same time. Let's build a YouTube first. Be committed to one thing first. Focus on succeeding on YouTube first before you move to a different platform. You got it? You may say, Daniel, I don't have the skills. I don't have the skills to set up proper lighting. I don't have the skills to set up my mic. Guys, I may not have the skills to do a lot of things. But if you have a desire to do it, if you have a vision, if you have a dream, if you have a plan, Learn the skills. This is what I'm teaching you on YouTube. Learn the skills. There's tons and tons of video out there. All you have to do is type in, how do I set up my lighting for YouTube? How do I set up my camera for YouTube? How do I set up my iPhone for YouTube? How do I set up my microphone, if you have a microphone, for YouTube? Think about those things and start applying them. Sometimes you may ask yourself, what if you feel? But what if you don't fail? What if you don't fail? What if you succeed? Ask yourself, what if you succeed? You have to want it. Your desire has to be outweighing them because they don't understand where God is taking you. They don't understand your vision for the future. They don't understand where you want to be in five years' time, in two years' time, in three years' time. We want to command our own future. We want to be our own boss. We want to make a difference in this world. We are living as designers original that God has created us to make a dent in the kingdom of hell. We are here. So when we walk, the enemy sees us and he says, touch not the Lord's anointed and do his servants no harm. Can't touch this. So guys, that's my fourth point. That's all I have for you right now. Trust this. This was inspirational to you. Because in 2022, you, I want to see you succeed in everything that you do. Make your plan. Decide how much videos you're going to do. And execute them like how a lion executes his prey. Okay, guys, so thank you for joining me here on King's Tech Review. Please like, share, and subscribe to this awesome channel. We want to bless your heart from the crown of your head to the sole of your feet. Thank you for joining me here. I will talk to you in the next video. God bless you. Bye.